Hey guys, this is Nina, and um, you might be wondering why is my hair plaited? Well, as you all know, I'm kind of curling my hair because I'm going to my nan's house and I want to look really pretty because my, it's my little brother's birthday as well, so um, when I get this down, it's going to be all curly. But that's not the main reason why I'm here. The main reason is that um, I'm going to show you my um, desk drawing desk in the daylight because the other one wasn't really good so without further ado let me go ahead and show you because I have to clean my room bye okay so as you all know I'm a big fan of drawing like drawing is my world and um so it has fantasy and all that that's why I like it and um my grandfather used to be a really good artist but he was mostly a painter but I think everyone says that I got skill off him. I'm not I'm not sure if I'm good at drawing. Like all these pictures are not my favourite except that man over there which you probably saw. But yeah, I'm just gonna get started. Okay, so I'm gonna start at the far corner. Okay, so why is my rubber here? <laughs> okay, sorry. Okay. So over here I just have a bunch of um random primary source paints. Like um these are for like basic paints. For art, so if I mix like red and yellow, it'll be orange. And I don't need to buy an orange pan of, can of paint. As you can see, I have to buy new ones because they're almost gone. But anyway, over here I have just like um, this is basically I call this my sketch paper because as you can see, um, I sketch mini pictures because um, I put them on a graph page, then it comes bigger out. And then I print it, and then I make loads. And then this is just, um, I was really bored at school, and I just done a whole bunch of 3D squares. And I don't know if you guys get this, um, but, okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you, what does that look like? Does that look like a girl? Well, if it looks like a girl, it's a fish. You mightn't realize how is that fish. Fins, um, thing, and the two eyes, and then the water in the background. Um, I done a better one. And then this one. I'm actually going to show you in this video. This is very simple. Um, all you need is a pen. How to do this. And this is a word drawing. By writing the name dog. Okay. Dog. Right. You can make a shape like a face. So what you do is you draw eyes and the two O's. And then the ear. Then you draw the nostrils. And you begin bringing this um, here for a smiley face. I'm holding the camera, so I'm not good at drawing this. Then you bring spiky hair or whatever. Oh my god, my camera's shaking and I can't draw good spiky hair. And then you bring the neck down. Um, as you can see, this looks way different from that. And that's because I'm holding the camera with my left hand and it's shaky. But you get the point. Okay. So this is just um a Justin Bieber picture kind of thing. I really like it because the amount of color makes it stand out. I'm not going to hang that up because... um um Actually, I might hang that up. I don't know. It's just really, like, plain for me. I'd rather buy, like, posters and all that. You get the point. So you get the point why I use this graph mats paper. I never throw out any papers. I keep them. Because I'll need them. Paper is recyclable. And I don't recycle it. Because I use it again. Okay, so. Um, um, this is my sister's mail. I don't know what the heck it's doing here. Sorry. So I have a bunch of colored papers up here. Like I have like um, my best paper. Which I'm not going to use. Like at the bottom. I have like a luminous paper. A luminous. You can't really see it. But these are like yellow luminous papers coming up to just normal papers. And I have like loads of stuff written on them. But I was going to throw it out. But I thought I would use it. Do you have my handwriting actually? But I'm going to use the back of these someday. I hope. Okay, so coming over here, this is basically my um, uh, pencil thingy. And I used to use this for makeup, but then like, yeah, I needed it. So I have my two paintbrushes and I use these for blending because I use like grey and black loads of times for my eyes and all that if I'm ever drawing. So I kind of need these. And then I have a bunch of sketch pencils like HB and um, dark, um, yeah, 
you get the point. Um, and then bunch of random stuff. Yeah, bunch of, bunch of random stuff. Um, highlighters and all that. And then I just have a rubber here. It's really cool. It's kind of like a Chinese girl or something. Yeah, I use rubbers a lot. So I have loads in my pens case as well. Because I like drawing at school as well. Bunch of duct tape to hang up my pictures that I really, really like. My trophy. Um, my uh, paper cutter. Dictionary. And then a bunch of handmade Christmas cards. They're really easy to do. I have like loads of... Christmas cards and then just post-its that I like drawing little mini pictures on. Alright, so I'm gonna go through my pictures. So I'm gonna start from here. This picture I love because this is the best picture I drew. And this was basically um very um emotional. And what it says here is help children and this is just a man um who's taken away the mother from the child of um because um there was a war and something like that. I don't know, out of my imagination. Yeah. I'm not really good, but I just thought. <laughs> um, then I just have a fist, um, broken vase that I drew like a very long time ago. But I still want to keep that for memories. Okay, so coming down here, we had to draw jam and um, grapes. So I thought I'd give it a little background. And then I drew a big... Well, we had to pick like if we wanted to write a poem and all that. And people said that I was so good at drawing that I had to draw something. So I just drew jam and grapes it was to do with the poem so and then i have this basic picture um when i was studying how to do um the side of people's faces um i shaded one and then i drew a woman and um, this is a woman and then this is a man and an old person and then a woman's head turned sideways so coming back down um i just have Pla plato plato this book that my dad made me read i just drew it um, it was really sunny in my sunroom, and it was loads of shadows, and this happened to be on the table, so I just drew it. Um, I just copied this. It's not really good. Um, and me and my sister were having a challenge, so I just drew this cute little puppy. I love this puppy. Oh my god. So cute. And then I drew this funny character man. Yeah, kind of cool. And then the last thing on this blank wall here, well, blank wall, seriously. I just drew an aggressive man and a load of face expressions you could do in art. And I kind of named them by people, but I didn't name them, but this is my sister. She's always lazy. This is my friend. This is my little brother and, you know, my classmate and friend. And then this is my sister, angry pup. <laughs> okay. Okay. So coming over to this wall, it's just like my basic um, drawings that I find that they're not really good, but good. Like, really cool. So, yeah, you can see who that is. And then basic cat who is weird. And then a little child on the phone. They didn't turn out good. Coming down our feet. Feet. And then my car. My little brother loves cars and he kept on telling me to draw one. So I just did. Um, just girl, turned out Chinese, but I don't care. And then, this little baby who was meant to be my little brother. Oh, he turned out weird. And he's wearing a little knitted jumper with buttons. Yeah, it's kind of cute. So I hope you enjoyed everything. Um, there's not really much to see. I just wanted to share it. Um, with all my videos, um, that are on my channel, um, I'm not trying to brag with all the videos I made or nothing. It's just people, random people put these up on YouTube. Like what I just showed you. People put up videos of their room, cleaning their room, makeup, collection, and room tours and everything. And I thought I'd just share that with you guys. And thank you for watching. Bye. Subscribe. Like. Dislike this video and comment. Hey.